Hi guys, welcome back to this channel. Today we're going to show you the list of anime similar to Full Dive. But before we get started, be sure to hit the like button and ring the notification bell for my videos. The anime entitled Full Dive The Ultimate Next Gen Full Dive RPG is even shittier than real life. It's an anime adaptation of a Japanese light novel series written by La Toichi. Media Factory has published three volumes of this anime since August 2020 under the MF Banku J print. Meanwhile, the manga adaptation by Kino has been released in Media Factory Zen and Manga Magazine Monthly Comic Live since January 2021. The anime adaptation will air in spring 2021 with 12 episodes in total and is produced by Studio Angie. The story tells about a young man named Hiroshi Yuki, who really likes virtual reality MMORPG games. One day, he played a game that was different from what he usually played. Unlike any ordinary games, this is a game that pushes realism to the most realistic point, that everything he feels will feel like real. Well, here's the list of anime similar to Full Dive. Number 10 is Hack Series. Hack is a Japanese multimedia franchise that includes two projects, Project Hack and Project Hack Conglomerate. It's created and developed by CyberConnect2 and published by Bandai Namco Entertainment. The series features an alternate historical setting in the rise of the new millennium regarding the rise of a new version of the internet technology after the massive global computer networking disaster of 2005 when mysterious events surrounding massively fictionalized multiplayer online roles are highly popularly called the world. The series originally consisted of anime and video games which were later adapted into manga, novels, and other related media. Number 9 is Death March to the Parallel World Rhapsody Death March to the Parallel World Rhapsody is an anime that aired in winter 2018 with 12 episodes in total. The Zanme is an adaptation of a Japanese light novel written by Hiro Ainana and produced by the studio Silver Link. The series began its realization online in 2013 on the user-generated novel publishing website Shosatsu Kanin Naru until it was acquired by Fujimi Shobu. A manga adaptation by Aya Megumu also began running in Age Premium until the magazine stopped publishing and later moved to monthly Dragon Age. The story revolves around Ichiro Suzuki, who is a game programmer assigned to fix several bugs in the game that will be published. One day, after taking break for a while and waking up, Ichiro finds himself transported to a parallel world that resembles the game world he's working on. In the end, it requires Ichiro to survive while looking for a way out of this game world. Number 8 is How Not to Summon a Demon Lord the anime How Not to Summon a Demon Lord almost has the same concept as the previous anime that they were summoned into the game world by accident. This is an anime adaptation of a light novel series written by Yukiya Murasaki and illustrated by Takahiro Surosaki. The anime premiered in summer 2018 with 12 episodes, and for the second season, will be released in spring 2021. The story tells about Takuma Sakamoto. Has a Hikikomori gamer who is mysteriously transported to the virtual world of his favorite MMORPG Cross Bravery. In the virtual world, Takuma's appearance as a Zem as his own character that he plays in the game. He's not even expecting himself to meet two girls who summoned him to that world, Ram Galyu and Shira L. Grintwood. And then the two of them accompany him throughout his journey in the fancy world. Number 7 is A New Thought There's Never a Girl Online. Commonly known as Natake ne Yome wa Onanako Janai to Omota, this anime is an anime adaptation of a light novel written by Shibai Kineko and illustrated by Hisazi. Asuki Media Works has published 21 volumes since 2013 under the Dankaki Banko imprint. A manga adaptation with art by Kazu Ishikami is serialized in Oski Media Week Scene in Manga Magazine. It tells about a teenager named Hideki Nishimura, who plays a multiplayer online role-playing game called Legendary Age or LA. 
has traumatized by all the girls in the game since he proposed to a girl online who is actually a boy. The experience meant Hideki distrust everything. Time passes and he meets Aiko, a girl who is infatuated with him, both in the game and the real world. But this girl can't tell the difference between fancy games and the real world. Number 6 is Ixion Saga TT. Ixion Saga TT is a Japanese anime television series based on the online game. It was directed by Capcom and adapted into two manga series and a light novel series. For the anime itself, it aired in fall 2012 with 25 episodes in total that was produced by Brand Base Studio. The story of the anime revolves around Kon Hokazi, who is an MMORPG player. One day, he accepted a request from a girl character in the game that made him overthinking. He was carried away in the fancy world without knowing how he got there and how to return to his own world. Over there, Khan is an honor god who is responsible to keep the princess safe while the militant faction of the princess's country attempts to capture him before he can complete his matchmaking. Number 5 is Recovery of an MMO Junkie Also known as Netji no Suzume, this anime is an adaptation of a Japanese manga series by Rin Kokuya which was originally released as a webtoon on the Comico app. Later, it was adapted into an anime television series in 2017 with 10 episodes in honor format. Mariko Marioka is a 30-year-old successful career woman who decides to quit her tax company job and become an outnet and find a more fulfilling life. Then, she joined the online MMORPG Vruits de Mer and created a male character named Hayashi as his avatar. In the game, Hayashi meets another character, Lily, a high-level player who helps him learn the game. Hayashi and Lily become close friends. One day, they had the opportunity to meet in the real world. Of course, very surprising things happened after they met. Number 4 is Excel World Excel World is an anime that art in spring 2012 with 24 episodes in total. The anime is an adaptation of a Japanese light novel written by Reiki Kawahara and illustrated by Hema. The series began to be published in Noski Media Works' Dengeki Banka print since February 2009. Not only the anime version, the series also got an adaptation for video game consoles which was released for the PlayStation Portable and PlayStation 3 consoles in 2012 and 2013. It tells the story of a figure named Haruyuki Arita, known as Haru. He's a short and fat man who always been bullied by his friends for a long time. Even so, using newer Linka, Haru tries to escape the torment of real life. He gets into the virtual world of the school's local network where he always plays virtual squash alone. This attracts Kuroyuki Hime, a student council vice president, who then introduces him to Brain Burst, a kind of secret program capable of speeding up human cognitive processes to the point where time seems to stop. Number 3 is Lock Horizon Lock Horizon premiered in fall 2013 with 25 episodes in total, and currently it has 3 seasons of broadcast. Lock Horizon is an anime adaptation from a Japanese light novel series written by Mamari Tono and illustrated by Kazuhiro Hara. The series began serialization online in 2010 on the user-generated novel publishing website Shosetsu Kaninaru which was later acquired by Enterbrain and published as a light novel in Japan since 2011. The series follows the strategists and other players of the MMORPG Alder Tale. They find themselves that they are taken away to the game world after the game update. There are 30,000 Japanese players who were logged on at the time of the update that suddenly found themselves transported to a virtual game world and wearing their in-game avatar. In the midst of commotion, a socially awkward gamer named Shiroi, along with his friends Naotsuki and Akatsuki, decide to work together in order to face this world and get out of the trouble they are facing. Number 2 is Sword Art Online Sword Art Online is a Japanese light novel series written by Reki Kawahara and illustrated by Abak. 
Kawahara originally wrote the series as a web novel on its website from 2002 to 2008. The light novels began publishing in Oski Media Works' Denkeki Banko print from April 10, 2009, with a spin off series launching in October 2012. Purchased by A1 Pictures, this anime began to be released in summer 2012 with 25 episodes in total. The story of this anime is set in a virtual reality world, to be precise, in a game world called Sword Art Online, which world is built on a game engine called World Seed. The story centers on Kasuta Kirigaya and Yuki Asuna, who are a pair of players in the various worlds of SAO. Number 1 is Overlord. Overlord is a Japanese light novel series written by Kagane Maruyama and illustrated by Sobin. The series began its realization online in 2010, before being acquired by Antibrain. The television anime series adaptation by Madhouse consists of three seasons set at different times. In the year 2126, a deaf massively multiplayer online role-playing game or DMMORPG called Yggdrasil was released in which the game has an unbelievably high ability for players to interact with the game. Even so, after an intense 12-year run, the game servers were about to shut down. But before the final minute of the server closing, one of the players named Mamunga reminisced for the last time he played the game. After the time came and the server shut down, Mamunga found himself still trapped in the game and unable to look out. In the end, he started to get used to living in the cave while looking for other people who might have the same fate as him, trapped in the cave. Well, that's all the list of anime similar to Will Dive. Do you have any favorite anime on the list? If you do, let us know in the comment section below. Be sure to hit the like button and share this video as much as you can to your friends if you really enjoy this. Thanks a lot for watching and see you next time.